My work is mostly focused on an algorithm called Between Essentiality, uh, which is a graph analytic that tries to find the most influential or important vertices within a network. And these vertices could be people in a social network. You could be tr trying to find terrorists in some sort of uh, crime ring. You could be trying to find uh, the intersections in the city to find the most interesting place to plan your new store or something. Uh, so it has really broad-reaching applications. Um, I do various parallel and distributed algorithms, and we found that NVIDIA GPUs are awesome for Between Essentiality because of their high memory bandwidth and their massive parallelism. So it's easier to express parallelism, we have more threads available, we have more compute units, um, and they're better not only in terms of performance, but also in terms of energy efficiency. So while I might be able to get a two or three X uh, performance improvement over prior GPU methods, that's also leading to a ton of energy efficiency and savings that way. And I've also been able to scale my methods out to using clusters of hundreds of GPUs um, and been able to uh, scale my work to graphs of sizes that weren't previously possible. So if you had a network of several million vertices and you wanted to find the most influential vertices by the method of between us and Chality, um, that, was, that would either take months to do or wasn't even possible at all. Um, so what my work has done is made that scalable to that size of a graph, which means that we're approaching the, the Facebook size graph where you can really find uh, interesting statistics out of uh, very, very massive data sets. The problems that I'm trying to solve can be applied to social network analysis, urban planning, epidemiology, and the spread of disease, and it has a really broad impact um, in all these fields. The NSA is very interested in this sort of work because it allows them to do uh, analyses over larger networks or in faster amounts of time. So what used to take them several days to figure out, they can now figure out in several hours, and that makes for a much better interactive cycle. So you know, you do some initial analysis and then you use the results of that analysis to do your next batch of work. So when that when the time between that batch of work is several days, you can't really get much done. But when that time of uh, impact is brought down to just several hours or even tens of minutes, um, then all of a sudden you go out and get a cup of coffee, you come back, and you can you can uh, continue on. Uh, the paper that I had at Supercomputing last year on between centrality using 192 NVIDIA GPUs uh, was actually just asked to be published in the communications of the ACM. It has a readership of over 100,000 people in over 100 countries. So um, not only people in the HPC community will, will learn about it, but people all over the computer science community, um, all over the world, will be able to have access to it. And that, that has been a fantastic result.